Hi guys! Um, yeah. Welcome to my room. We are in a different section of my room. We are on my bed facing the decorated wall. If you- oh, little plug if you want to see how my makeup turned out like this. I did a tutorial and I'll put it up on Sunday. Um, I know it's rant day Wednesday, but I just went shopping and I'm about to do the most epic, massive haul you've probably seen in a really long time because there's this mountain of things to tell you about buying. Um, okay, let's start. Well, we'll start off with rag stock because that's where I went first. We are in Chicago and I bought this scarf. It is vintage. It was from the limited originally. Really old limited though. And it was $3. It is silk. They had a sale on silk vintage scarf for $3 and I got really excited. Um, next, we I bought this really adorable collared Scotty shirt. Like, Scottish Terrier shirt. It's just adorable. I mean, it's like not pebble or anything. That's got some really adorable collar. And I'm going to a school where the mascot is Scotty. And so I thought to have a Scottish Terrier shirt would just be so fitting. So I bought this. Um, it was like four dollars. Hey, I found my tea. I was so thirsty. Um, and then I bought these little turtle shell hipster glasses. Because they're just adorable and they were 99 cent and I haven't seen how I look in them so oh my god they're so cute I just love these um I love big glasses hipster glasses it's just my thing and then I bought these from my mom because she tends to like things like this and they were also 99 cents and yeah that is my ragstock haul oh, I'm so thirsty and I found this bottle of tea in the bag that I bought and now I'm so happy. Oh, spilled tea on my face. Yep, all of my face. Cute. Moving on to what is next? Zara. I love Zara and we don't have a Zara and so when I saw one I kind of went overboard with the excitement. I only bought one thing so I was kind of broke at that point. I bought this little rainbow shirt here. That's the back of it. This is the front. It's just a big rainbow shirt and I thought it was adorable and that I could wear it with like jeans or leggings or a skirt or shorts. I didn't have a lot of things with lots of colors on them. I tend to stay like one, two colors per item. But this is what I got from Zara and it's adorable. I just love it to death. Like, it is so cute. Um, moving on to Forever 21 thing I bought from here is dirty so as soon as I wear it I, put, I show you guys I'm going to put dirty clothes I bought a plain black skater dress um, it's got like a flowy circle skirt that's part of a skater dress it was $10 and I've been looking for one of these for a really long time it's got a little low back I wore it yesterday if you follow me on Instagram you'll or on Tumblr you'll see that I posted a picture of my outfit yesterday I did it with a big denim shirt and a scarf and then this little skater dress which I adore but it's going to dirty clothes cuts dirty so that was my purchase from there on to wet seal I'm so happy I found these I've been looking for galaxy leggings for a really low price for a while and I thought I would never find them but I found these galaxy leggings for five dollars at wet seal Thank God for what seal I was about to cry. I couldn't find them for like under thirteen and I didn't want to spend thirteen dollars. These were originally fifteen and I got them for five and I just can't wait to wear these. I'm trying to find the perfect outfit. They have like clouds on the butt and like moons and things and oh my god, I'm just so happy like that I have these in my life now. It's crazy. I don't think you guys know what it's like when you want to find something so bad and then you find it and then it's just like the best feeling ever. On to, wow, this is going a lot faster than I expected. We are on to my last store that I went to in Chicago. Um, I went to Topshop. 
and I went to a top shop, but I'm too poor to afford top shop. So I went in and bought accessories because they were on sale. I bought these little cross earrings for 75% off. Um, I don't know why I haven't been really into the cross trend, but these were just adorable. And I've been into studs more than like big danglies recently because working at a preschool, it's hard to have big dangly earrings and not get them yanked out of your ears by small children. But now that that's over, I'm still kind of into the studs. So I bought these little crosses. Um, I just think they're like simple and really cute. And they go with a lot of stuff I have because they're multiple colors. And then my last purchase from Topshop was this little headscarf. It is purple and things and purple and pink. And there's a bow that you can tie on your head around the headband piece it's just really cute and I'm really excited to find somewhere to wear it um I don't have anywhere to wear it but I just can't wait to wear it oh I did so much shopping this is like the most shopping I've done like an entire year so from Topshop I only spent like nine dollars because I got a student discount yay for being a student and then I went online and bought shoes because I'm a shoe addict so thank you shoe dazzle Thank you, Shoe Dazzle, for your purchases. Um, I bought three pairs of shoes from Shoe Dazzle. I bought these little black ankle boots with gold toe decorate with the like gold decorations because I haven't had a pair of black ankle boots and I really like ankle boots. Like, if you follow like legit follow me on Instagram or Twitter or Tumblr and I Instagram a lot of pictures and post a lot of pictures of my outfits, and I should do that. Also doing that more, um, here, I just love ankle boots, and I will probably get a lot of use out of these. I haven't had a pair of black ones, these are simple, and I'm moving to the south so it's not very cold, so it'll help to have, like, the shorter ankle boots so that I'm not, like, burning to death. Oh god, the back backs. Okay, and then, I think these are the other pair of ankle boots I bought. They... These have more of like a rug print, and I just thought they were adorable. Like, the print on them is gorgeous, and I can't wait to wear them. They have a little heel, and I like heels because I'm really short. I'm like 4'11, 4'10, doesn't even, I don't even know. So I bought these really cute, like, little ankle boots with rug print and a little heel. I have a pair of these that are suede and brown, but I don't didn't think they were like exciting enough so I bought a pair with more stuff to them. I think I'm gonna save these to bring to college in October when I come home from break for a break and just bring them back with me. Sorry about that loud noise that was me trying to attempt to close a box that I'm going to try to close in. The last pair I bought were a little pair of brown platform wedges. Um, I really like wedges because they're like a heel, but they're non-committal because you don't have to be like going somewhere nice to wear wedges. You can just wear them like day to day. And these are kind of low and they have a really high platform and I like that because I think they'll go up a lot. And I don't have a pair of brown wedges, so they have strappy little sand, they're like strappy little sandal wedges and I'm so excited to wear all of these things. Um like the stuff I got from virtually when I wore already. I bought some socks there too, but I feel like showing you guys the socks because they weren't exciting. I just bought them because I forgot to pack shoes. Socks for vacation. I only packed shoes that need socks and it just sucked. So yeah, um, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr. The links are in the down bar. I'll put them there. Sorry, it's not a rant. This is what you're getting today. I was just too excited. I wanted to share stuff with you guys. So I love you guys. And I'll post my everyday makeup tutorial on Sunday. Um, that's it. Oh, also, I partnered with Austin this TV. So if you see that everywhere, just know. Bye, guys.